search for answers is on this morning after a fatal condo fire at Chicago's northwest side. An elderly man died and a woman was hurt in that fire. CBS 2's V. Wynn joins us live now from the Dunning neighborhood with details for us. Good morning, V. Good morning, Marissa and Aaron. The medical examiner just identified the victim as 88 year old Radisol Sodzak. Neighbors tell me he lived on the fifth floor of this condo building with a woman in this unit believed to be his wife. One man who lives right across from them with his son says the alarms went off in his unit. He opened the door and the hallway was filled with smoke. I immediately closed the door and I yelled at him, We got to get out of here. So he came with me. I opened the door again. I could see the unit across the way's door open. There was a glow in there, and I just, me and him turned around. Fortunately, it's not that far out to the uh, exit way, and we got into the uh, stairwell. Now, Russell Burzik moved into the Ridgemore Estate condo building at least 20 years ago. He says he would see his neighbors in passing, and now he can't believe Sodzak is gone. That's what's it's bothering me. It's tough. Start thinking about yourself, you know, could have been me, and it's just you just feel bad. I wish I could have helped them. The fire happened overnight at 6460 West Bell Plain. Firefighters got the call around 345 this morning. Dozens of residents had to evacuate. The two victims, Sodzak and the woman, were taken to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. A fire spokesperson tells me the woman was stable when she was transported. She told firefighters she heard the smoke detectors go off in their condo, condo hallway. Now, the fire spokesperson also tells me there were no smoke detectors in the victim's unit. At this time, the fire is believed to be active. Accidental, possibly started in the utility room in Unit 511. Reporting live on the city's northwest side, V1 CBS 2 News. Back to you. All right.